So I know it can be so overwhelming in this season right now. As you see, the left has hijacked education. The left has hijacked uh, the, the, the mountain of finance. You know, the banks have gone woke. The CEOs have gone woke. You see the entertainment industry. I mean, it's, it's crazy. The perversion that is so pervasive uh, across the board. Um, obviously, the government sector. We've seen, you know, some of the craziest leftist leaders leading our country. And I think a lot of times for believers, it, it, it's hard to have hope. It's hard to really believe. But I'm telling you, one institution a God-ordained institution that we are not going to let fall prey to the left's agenda, and that's the church. The church of Jesus Christ. This is the season where the church is rising up with power and authority, and we're seeing it from coast to coast. You know, we visited 21 capitals and counting, and I'm telling you, there is a bold, righteous, church that is rising up to meet the hour. And just as we've seen before with the Great Awakenings, just as we've seen with the Jesus People Movement, Azusa Street, the moves of God throughout history, I believe this is an hour where the church is going to rise up and bring salvation to America and bring revival to this nation. We need it now more than ever. And I want to encourage all of you out there, what I've seen in America over the last six months, I would have never dreamed in my lifetime. So now is not a time to be discouraged. It's time for us to take heart and believe that God has a plan. He's writing this story and the story is going to end well. So continue to engage with us. Listen, we're bringing the party to the West Coast in a few weeks. We're going to be in Olympia, Washington. We're going to be in uh, Salem, Oregon. We're going to be in Boise, Idaho. And we're going to continue in the Pacific Northwest bringing the fire. And we want to see you there. L click the link. Subscribe to our podcast. Be a part of this movement. Don't fall into discouragement and despair. We can't afford for that right now. This is the hour for a church to rise with boldness and courage, and you are that church. God bless you guys.